The MTA announcing today the groundbreaking to make the Classen Avenue G train station more accessible. News 12's Karina Gary is in bed with the details. I can't do it. It's impossible. I would call FDNY to carry me down or to carry me up. For Kalia, Hazlett, and other wheelchair users, taking the Classen Avenue G train has never been an easy option. Without an, an elevator or an escalator, it is absolutely not possible. This new project and millions of dollars provided by the federal government will help the station be a step closer to accessibility in the next two years. Fully accessible under the Americans with Disabilities Act. Jano Lieber, chair and CEO of the MTA, says they will be adding three new elevators, making it so people like Kalia are able to utilize the subway. It's a new transit and accessibility is a priority. But not everyone agrees with Kalia's assessment of the MTA. Dustin Jones, a disability rights activist, doesn't trust the MTA to make good on their promise to make 95% of stations ADA accessible by 2055. They're speaking out of both sides of their mouths, and I don't appreciate that. Congestion pricing increases were aimed to help bring more accessibility to stations across the city. Dustin doesn't believe congestion pricing should factor whether or not these stations are improved. Not a fan of congestion pricing, but I do believe that the MTA needs to fund itself by any means necessary. The construction at Classen Avenue Station is expected to be completed by 2026. In Bed-Stuy, Karina Gary, News 12 Brooklyn.